Well known for its short legs and famous silhouette, the Scottish Terrier is a lovely, playful and protective dog breed. They are a big dog in a small package, nicknamed the Die Hard breed, which will stand up against every dog and fight till the end. With their strong character, they are famous since several hundred years. In this video, I teach you everything about the Scottish Terrier, based on 10 topics, so you can find out if this breed is made for you. Number 1. Origin The Scottish Terrier breed has an old and unclear history. Even though much of their beginnings are undocumented, researchers are still able to conclude that the Scottish Terrier is one of the oldest breeds in Scotland, and is the original foundation for all Terrier breeds. Starting in the early 1400s, the Scottish Terrier was seen in different Scottish novels and books, playing a main role in everyday life. During the 17th century, the Scottish Terrier became more famous in France and since then was used for their hunting skills, excelling at catching vermin and other small animals. Number 2. Personality The Scottish Terrier's personality is confident, fearless and feisty. They also have a tendency to be quite independent and love to play with the members of the family. They are skeptical of strangers or other dogs and it takes a while for them to warm up to someone. This makes them a great watchdog for the whole family. Once they warm up to you, they will be a loyal companion for life. Just with other terrier breeds, Scotties can be very sensitive at times. When they are still in their early puppy years, they are extremely playful and spunky, so if you consider adopting a Scottish Terrier, you should get a newborn puppy. Number 3. Appearance The Scottish Terrier is a small, short-legged dog with a compact and sturdy build. The average height is 10 inches, which is 25 centimeters. The weight ranges from 19 to 22 pounds, which is 8 to 10 kilograms. Despite his size, he doesn't yap. He has a powerful bark that can scare the wits out of the unsuspecting burglar or delivery person. His head is long in proportion to his size. His very special keen, piercing expression and his erect ears and tail are salient features of the breed. Number 4. Trainability The Scottish Terrier likes to challenge their owners while training. Even though they are an intelligent breed, they can be very independent, making them have a mind of their own. If a Scotty doesn't feel like training that day, chances are that they will just go and do whatever they want. This breed is best with an owner who has a lot of experience in training a challenging breed. Due to their sensitive characteristics, make sure to never scold or punish them, especially during training. For additional support, try enrolling them in a puppy training course. And when training a Scottish Terrier, make sure to start the process as early on as possible. If you want to learn more about dog brain training and training secrets, check out the description. Number 5. Time Investment Even though they are an energetic breed, they only require a moderate level of physical activity each day. You should walk your dog 20 to 40 minutes daily to keep them healthy and happy. Besides that, Scottish Terriers are not a needy breed, which means they can be left alone for a few hours. Whenever you spend time with them, make sure to socialize them with unfamiliar people, dogs, sounds and experiences. This will make them feel more comfortable in everyday situations. They are not made for endurance, so try to stay away from long runs or hikes. They more enjoy chasing the kids around in the yard or playing tug of war with a family member. Number 6. Coat Many people know Scottish Terriers with their black coat, but they can also be grey or steel, brindle or wheaten. This breed has two coats, the top coat or overcoat, which is hard and wiry, and the bottom coat or undercoat, which is soft and dense. Because his hair just keeps growing, he doesn't shed as much as short-coated breeds. You should groom your Scotty once a week, and to make this easier, you can set up a grooming table to bring the dog up to your level. Your Scottish Terrier should be clipped every two months if your aim is to keep his hair short. If you want to keep the hair long, you should trim it several times a year. Did you like this video so far? It would mean a lot to us if you subscribe to our channel, we upload new videos every day. Number 7. Best Home Scottish Terriers are great for children. Some people have even nicknamed this breed the Nanny because of their protective qualities. Loud and rowdy toddlers may be too much for a Scotty to handle. Older children who know how to handle and care for a dog would be a better fit for this breed. Toddlers tend to be rough when playing with smaller dogs, which can make a Scotty snappy or aggressive. 
They love to play with all of their family members and don't necessarily need children around them. So as a single or couple, this breed will also fit perfectly into your family. Just make sure to spend more time with them to provide them social interaction. Number 8. Health The Scottish Terrier are generally healthy, but like all breeds of dogs, they are prone to certain conditions and diseases. Some of the occurring conditions are Scotty Cramp, Von Willebrand disease or Patella Luxation. When buying a puppy, a good breeder will discuss with you what they have encountered in their lines and if you want to know more about this breed, you can talk to your veterinarian or other dog owners. Number 9. Costs The cost to buy a Scottish Terrier varies greatly and depends on many factors such as the breeder's location, reputation, litter size, lineage of the puppy and many more. The median price for Scottish Terriers is $1100. If you are looking for a dog with a superior lineage or even for a puppy with show quality, this can cost you anywhere from $1600 to over $5000. Besides the first time costs, this breed costs you an additional $500 to $1000 a year for wet bills, food, training and toys. Number 10. Diet a Scottish Terrier should be fed 1 to 1.5 cups of high quality food a day split into two separate servings. The amount of food is dependent on their activity level, metabolism, age and size. Make sure to consult with your veterinarian for a complete feeding regime and cater to your unique dog. Smaller breeders can easily become overweight or obese, so feeding them the proper amount can be critical for their overall health. The quality food you provide them is also an important factor. Look for all natural and organic products that contain no soy, preservatives or fillers. Do you consider adding a Scottish Terrier to your family or already have one? Let us know in the comments and share your experience. If you are interested in dog brain training and training secrets, check out the description. Subscribe to our channel if you want to learn more about dogs in the future.